for how many months should I buy a hosting service? Paul says, Hi, web hosting companies comes with different plans. It's a monthly plan, quarterly plan and yearly plan. Companies offer the discounts in their yearly plan. It's beneficial to both company and the users. If you go with monthly plan then it became costly as compared to yearly plan. So, it's always being better to take the yearly plan of web hosting. I practically used Domain Racer web hosting which gives the monthly plan too with reasonable price. This gives the very affordable services. With the very compatible pricing plan Domain Racer offers the exciting features of web hosting. It have the lowest pricing for all type webs hosting like shared hosting, dedicated hosting, VPS hosting and reseller hosting. Features of web hosting by Domain Racer with monthly plan. Domain Racer is the company which gives the highest security with latest security tool like iMunify AV Plus and iMunify 360. With the larger space it gives the powerful SSD storage and 99.99% .99 uptime. One click installation of softwares and many more features are provided by this company. Choice of server location is allowed by the Domain Racer. 24 by 7 expert support is ready to solve the problems of users. Budget is the factor which plays the important role for any type business. If you really looking for a web hosting company with outstanding feature and affordable price then Domain Racer is the best option for you. Hope this answer will help you. Jorian Langazal says, The thing with hosting companies are, the longer period you are buying the plan for, the cheaper it gets. So it's good to have that in mind. Usually the plans can get even up to 48 months suggesting the cheapest price, and one month would be the most expensive, while you are buying the same plan. Also, remember that most hosting companies will have higher price while renewing the plan. So if you buy a plan for a year, you are already paying more, and then you need to renew the plan and the price might be even a bit higher. My suggestion, take your time, research the hosting provider, so you know what you are going with and then you can purchase the plan for the longest and most budget-friendly price. And don't worry about upgrading. If you are sticking to the same company I'm sure they will let you upgrade with no problems, in case your webpage outgrows the limits. Also, most reliable hosting providers will have a refund policy for the first month, so you have some time to check around, check the uptime, reliability of customer support and generally whether you feel good with the company. Some people prefer to keep changing the hosting providers, and always try to get the best deal, but remember, if you keep changing the hosting providers, you'll need to also keep migrating your site, which can be a hassle. Morris Benson says, just about every hosting service out there will offer you some form of a discount, maybe 10% to 50% or something like 1 to 2 months free, if you give them a quarter, half a year, or an entire year's worth of hosting revenue in a single payment. And it makes sense for them, after all, they get your money quicker and can deploy it to grow their businesses. There's nothing wrong with that. The answer to the question is, it depends. If you are financially sound, you can opt for a yearly plan. The good thing with a yearly subscription is that you won't need to worry about payments for a whole year, which is great in case you have some financial problems along the way. If you're cash strapped, you might opt for monthly or quarterly payments. This eases any financial strain on your end. We are all different and what works for you might not work for someone else. I have been hosting with Skysilk because they have competitive prices, premium grade resources, and 99.9% .9 uptime. You won't be disappointed. Thank you for watching our video on, for how many months should I buy a hosting service?